What if I told you that you don't need to dance, film yourself, or even be on camera to run a viral dance account? The video you're watching was recreated entirely, movement for movement, from an existing dance clip. But the person dancing isn't real at all. In this video, I'll walk you through how to take any dance video and transform it into a realistic dancing AI influencer that copies the exact motion, expressions, and energy of the original performance. And even if you've never created anything with AI, this is going to be the simplest video you'll watch because it has a clear process you can follow. So if you're serious about creating scroll-stopping AI dancing influencer videos that actually performs, then like the video because it's free, and let's jump right in. To create your AI dancing influencer videos, the first thing you need to do is get the dance videos you want to recreate. You can do this from TikTok or even Instagram, but for this tutorial, I'm going to focus specifically on TikTok. Go to TikTok and look for dance videos that feature only one person dancing. This is important because it makes it easier to replicate the movement later. Once you find a dance video that you want your AI influencer to recreate, open that video and copy the link to that TikTok video. Once you've copied the link, head over to Google and search for No Watermark TikTok Downloader. From the results, open this TikTok downloader called Save TT. When the site opens, paste the TikTok video link into the provided field and click on Search. The video will load, and you'll now be able to download it from here. Then go back to TikTok, find another dance video, copy the link, paste it into Save TT, and download it. Keep doing this until you have all the dance videos you need to recreate your AI influencer dancing in those exact styles. Once you have your dance videos downloaded, play one of them. And before letting the video play fully, move it back to the very first frame, right before the dance starts, and pause it there. This first frame is important because it shows the initial pose of the dancer, and that's the pose you want to recreate with your AI influencer. With the video paused on the first frame, open your snipping tool and snip that frame. This gives you an image of the dancer in that exact pose. Save that image, as you'll use it in the next step. At this point, you also need an image of your AI influencer that clearly shows how they look. This will act as your main reference image. Once you have both images ready, the image of your AI influencer and the image you snipped from the first frame of the dance video, you can move on to the next step, which is creating your AI influencer in that exact pose. Now, go ahead and open OpenArt, and the link to OpenArt is in the description. So, if you don't already have an account, sign up first. We're using OpenArt here because it gives us access to Nano Banana Pro, which is very good at maintaining consistency. This is important when recreating the exact pose from the dance video. Another reason I prefer using OpenArt is that it gives you access to many AI tools all in one place without needing to pay for multiple separate subscriptions. You can use top image and video generation tools from a single platform, which makes the whole process much easier. After signing in to open art, you'll land on the home page. From there, go to the image tab at the top and select create image. This will open the image generation tool. Before doing anything else, switch the model to Nano Banana Pro. Once that's done, we'll upload our reference images before writing the prompt. Under the Omni Reference section, upload your AI influencer image first. This image represents the character you want to recreate dancing. Then upload the second image, which is the one you snipped from the first frame of the dance video. This image represents the exact pose you want your AI influencer to copy. After uploading both reference images, move on to the prompt section. The prompt here is very simple. All you need to type is, image one is posing like image two, same camera angle. That's it. Once the prompt is done, scroll down to the output settings. Set the size to mobile, which is the 916 aspect ratio. For the resolution, switch it to 2K so you get better image quality, although you can leave it at 1K if you prefer. For the number of images, leave it at 2, as that's more than enough. Then click on Create, and Nano Banana Pro will generate the images for you. Compare the two results and choose the one that looks best, then download it. With your AI influencer image now ready in the correct pose, it's time to create the dance video. Switch over to the Video tab on the left side and select Motion Sync. Once you're in the Motion Sync section, the first thing you need to do is choose the model. 
make sure you switch it to Kling 2.6 and upload your AI influencer image under the Select Your Character option. This should be the image you just created using Nano Banana Pro. Then, under Add Motion Reference, upload the dance video you downloaded earlier from TikTok or Instagram, and scroll down and leave Keep Original Sound set to Yes. Under Motion Reference Control, leave it set to Exact, and under Video Mode, keep it on Standard. The prompt section here is optional. You can leave it empty and simply click Create, letting Kling 2.6 handle everything using the Motion Control feature. If you do want to add a prompt, you can use a simple one like the example example shown. Once you're ready, click Create, and Kling 2.6 will start generating the video for you. In a previous video, I showed how to create a dancing AI influencer using OpenArt Motion. For this tutorial, however, we're using the new Kling 2.6 motion control model, so you can see the difference. I'll link that earlier video in the description so you can watch it later and compare the results. Now, before we continue, I just want to share that I'm creating a brand new video course that will show you exactly how you can use an AI avatar to build your own brand and start monetizing it online in different ways. So if you've ever wanted to start content creation or even a YouTube channel but didn't want to show your face, or maybe you've wanted to create content but don't have the budget for recording equipments, then this is going to be perfect for you. Right now, I've opened a waitlist for those who want to learn how to do this once the course is ready. The spots are very limited, and once they fill up, I won't be reopening the waitlist again. So, if you'd like to be among the first people to get early access and special early bird pricing when the course launches, make sure you join using the first link in the description before the spots fill up. And thank you so much to everyone who has already joined. I really appreciate it. But if you haven't joined yet, make sure you don't miss this opportunity. Go ahead and click that first link in the description and sign up before the doors close. All right, now let's get back to the video. Once the video is ready, you can review it and download it. Now we are going to review the video that we just created, but I won't play it with sound because of copyright reasons. Instead, I'll mute the audio and show you the original dance video side by side with the recreated AI influencer video. This way, you can clearly see the motion, expressions, and how closely Kling 2.6 was able to recreate the dance. As you can see, Kling 2.6 does an excellent job of recreating the dance from the original TikTok video. The result turned out really well and the motion control is very impressive. This is exactly how you can create your own AI dancing influencer videos and start posting them on platforms like TikTok, Instagram, YouTube Shorts, or even Facebook. You can repeat the same process for all the other dance videos you downloaded and continue building content for your AI influencer. And by the way, all the tools mentioned in this video are linked in the description below. If you want to see how I created the dancing influencer using the different model, you can watch the previous video linked in the description. And you can join the waitlist using the first link in the description. Also, like the video, because it's free, and I'll see you in the next one.